How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to read the newspaper on your Kindle Fire. I'm going to show you first how to download it, then how to read it, and just tell you a little bit about the subscription cost and how it works. So let's come to the upper left corner and go to Newsstand. Click on that. And we want to go to Store, which is in the upper right corner. And now it's going to take you to the, this is the little Kindle Newsstand Store. Got magazines, newspapers, blah blah blah. So let's hit see all so you can just see some of the different newspapers that are available. New York Times, uh, USA Today, Washington Post, uh, LA Times. And on the right it shows the different prices, how much it is per month. Um, so let's do this. Let's hit LA Times. Okay. And so at the top it shows you the subscription costs. Uh, you can just buy one issue for $0.75 cents, or you can pay $10 a month and get the new issue every day. Okay, so that's pretty cool. It updates automatically. And here right here it says, for your convenience, issues are automatically delivered wirelessly to your Kindle starting at 5 a.m. L.A. time, local time. So that's a cool uh, feature. If you were to subscribe to it every morning at 5 a.m., the paper will be there for you. And... Um, this one has a 14-day trial, so I'm going to go ahead and hit uh, subscribe now, and now it's going to uh, download it for me so I can test it. We can see what it looks like, and uh, this is pretty cool, especially if you're a big newspaper reader. You know, you don't have to go out and buy paper every day. You can just have it downloaded right to your Kindle and read it right on here at your leisure. Let's go ahead and hit read now, and here it is. It shows you all the front page stories, and then you can kind of separate it by section. So we got world news. Uh, the nation opinion. I want to go see what's going on in sports. So let's keep going. Let's see if, if we hit the search. Let's hit sports and hit go. And it brings up a bunch of uh, sports highlights. So all different, it actually, it's a keyword search, you'll search the word. So let's make it even more specific. I'm going to type in the Lakers because the Lakers just lost their season opener to the Clippers yesterday. So I want to see what the headlines, I know there's a story about that in the paper. So, I think it missed it. Let's try it again. Lakers, hit go. And for some reason, it's a little tripping, so I'm going to go back, and now I'm going to type in Lakers, the main search area. And I spelled Lakers wrong. How cool is that? All right, third or fourth time's a charm. Lakers, there we go. All right, so now you can see up here, it's doing a search on the Lakers, and we have a bunch of things. We have... Um, the story about Kobe Bryant, a divorce. We have the score of the game, the different um, statistics from different people. Got a Clippers thing. So this is cool. You can actually do a keyword search, and you might like this too. Maybe we can just type in jobs to say if you're looking for a job. We can hit that. This is weird. I guess you have to go back. You can't do a search in that same search. You have to go back to... Um, the this main page here and then type it in and it works a little bit better let's see here we can do a job search and um look at this mm. you possibly may find some you know job uh listings if you search that way it looks like this is more of just show you some of the article stuff but this is kind of a nutshell what it looks like to read the paper I'm gonna go back to the main uh, area here and this is just cool though how we can go down to each section or we can come up here and just hit section and then we can jump right to where we want to go so sports like that and now it took me right to all the sports articles that would you would find in the sports section you got the pro calendar so you can see all the different uh, teams in LA and you can see all their different stories and um, I like that though that's really cool let's go back here now remember you can change the size of the fonts let's pick a story real quick let's say if we went to Trojans like uh, SC stuff we're gonna tap the center of the screen 
hit the uh, little A right here. Then we can change the spacing of the article. We can change the margin so it can be bigger or smaller. We can go black on white, white on black, or sepia as well. So it kind of helps your eyes a little bit with the colors. And then the font sizes, we can go small so we can get more on the page, or we can go big. I'm not sure who would need that big, but hey, if you do, I'm not judging. And uh, you can even change the uh, the font type. So this is really cool. And this is just uh, some of the features that are available when you read the paper on the um, Kindle Fire. And again, a 14-day trial of LA Times. And as you go down, it changes the sports. So bowling, well, as you know, that was in the newspaper. Um, we can even jump right to obituary, calendar, business, California, opinion, front page as well. So we can see whatever the front page article is. So this is in a nutshell. This is what uh, reading the paper looks like on the Kindle Fire. So uh, I say, hey, give it a try, 14-day trial, see if you like it. If you like it, hey, you know, you may want to go ahead and try it this way. And you can cancel the subscription at any time so you're not committed in case you decide there you don't want to do it. But um, that's how you download a newspaper. And uh, hope that was helpful. Have a good one.